Welcome into Rogue Football. I'm your host, Jordan DeLuga. Thank you so much for tuning in here today. We are talking about Joe Alt getting into an NFL draft scouting report for the Notre Dame left tackle. NFL bloodlines for this kid. His dad played for the Kansas City Chiefs for a long time. You love to see that. Has very long arms, long frame as a whole. He's over six foot seven, 322 pounds. Just a really, really tall offensive tackle. He is my OT2 behind Olu Fashanu right now for 2024. He is more technically refined with his hands. They are high, they are inside, and he times his punches really well. He can stab you, get you off balance. And like Fashanu, only 20 years old. This is a young, young prospect playing at a high level at a young age. Really good to see that. You see the block framing from him, which is key at the next level. The ability to strike moving targets. You love that at the next level. Against blitzes, he's very solid as well. Very coordinated pass protector with feet and hands matching up consistently. Very smart assignment sound. Always getting to his landmarks, both in the run and passing game. Very strong hands overall. Can redirect very well. You know, pick up those stunts and games up front. Well, I do think that Joe Alt is a very good athlete, Fashanu is an elite athlete. Where I do think that Joe Alt has a good anchor, Fashanu has a great anchor. And I just don't think you see the same level of flexibility and movement skills as a whole. I think sometimes you do see Joe Alt getting out over his toes and losing balance. Doesn't have the same level of balance as Olu Fashanu for me. But his combination of athleticism, technical refinement, youth, NFL bloodlines, and length for me, this guy is close to blue chip, not quite blue chip, but a top 10 prospect in pretty much any draft class that you would look at. There will be some times where shorter players will out leverage him. You know, at six foot seven, he's going to be going up against some pass rushers that are significantly shorter than him and have the natural leverage advantage. You also, if you can get into his chest, you can definitely knock him back. I think power at the point of attack and power in his anchor overall is a little bit more average than, than good. I still think that Joe Alt, with his length, athleticism, and overall skill set, technically refined, he should be an immediate starter in the NFL, at least a year one starter at some point during that rookie year with Pro Bowl potential early on. Again, thanks to that length, technical refinement, and athleticism. Like I said, he is OT2 for me. Really love his game. Big fan of what he brings to the table. He's just not quite at the same level of an Olu Fashanu, who I think is close to generational, at least in his physical ability. But any team that needs a tackle should be happy to land Joe Alt early in round one.